Hey guys, it's Martin here from Mattress Clarity. I've got the Pacific Coast Down Comforter with Pyrenees Down. Can we taking a look at the key features and if it's a good value for you. Let's get started. All right, before we get started, if you have any questions or comments or need any recommendations on comforters, just leave them in the comments below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But let's get started here. All right, let's look at some key features. The outside is gonna be 100% Egyptian down, really nice smoothness to it. It's about 420 for the uh, thread count. So it's gonna have a nice smooth quality to the outside, really, really nice. Uh, it's gonna have a barrier weave technology for the fabric. It's gonna keep all that down inside and those feathers and the down from escaping, which is really, really necessary. Um, and it works really well on this comforter as well. Um, inside, you're gonna have a Pyrenees down. It's 650 fill power. Fill power is going to be one ounce of down. They usually put it in a graduated cylinder and what at maximum loft it fills in cubic inches. So 650 is gonna be one ounce of down. It's gonna reach 650 cubic inches. So it's gonna be, it's like a medium number. Uh, you can go up as high as 800, 900, but it's gonna be uh, a lot higher fill power. You can go lower, like down to like the 450s, so it's not gonna have quite the insulating quality. But 650 is gonna be in the medium. Um, it's gonna be pretty nice for this as well. Um, it's hyper cleaned. Uh, big problem you have with down is gonna be for you allergy sufferers out there. The hyper clean technology they use is gonna clean the down up to eight times. It's gonna fight dust mites and allergens that would cause uh, problems for you as well. Um, in terms of dimensions, it's gonna be an oversized. So this is 108 by 96 inches. It's a king size, it's a queen bed, so it's even bigger, but uh, it's designed to have that nice overhang as well. Um, for me, I had a really nice experience with this. Um, I am a warmer sleeper, uh, so there was a little bit of extra warmth there, but it had really nice breathability. And so when I was sleeping, I never felt that clammy, uh, sweaty experience. Also, this, this outer shell is just really, really smooth and nice on the skin when you're sleeping. And so all this kind of adds up to a really nice experience for, for you sleepers out there. All right, let's talk about the pros and cons here for the Pacific Coast. Um, first, this is a luxury comforter for early value price. It's $130. You're getting Pyrenees down in there, which is gonna be a rare goose down with really nice insulation. It's also got the baffle box design, which is gonna allow for more loft, which is usually found on more of a luxury comforter. So there's a lot of nice qualities here uh, for a really good price. Um, in addition to that, if you suffer from allergies, uh, this is gonna be hyper clean. They have the hyper clean technology. It's gonna wash the down inside up to eight times. It's gonna fight dust and allergens. And if you do have a problem with uh, this comforter, 30 day allergy free guarantee. So if you have a problem, the first 30 days return for a full refund. And then uh, finally, this overhang, this is a king size on a queen mattress, so it's gonna be even more overhang, but it is designed to kind of have that nice drape. I really like the drape on this, and I think it was really nice if you like that kind of full draping experience. Uh, potential cons, it is gonna be a warmer comforter, so if you are a super hot sleeper, it might be a little bit too hot for you. Um, I'm a, like a warm sleeper, but it had nice breathability, so I had a nice experience experience with that. Um, it is gonna be on the thinner side, even with that Baffleback technology, it's only 40.5 ounces of filling, which is a good fill, but also it's just not gonna have quite the fluff you might get with certain comforters. You might wanna look for even a higher fill power if that's what you're looking for. This is 650, you wanna look for something like in the late, like high 700s to 800s as well. Um, and then finally, for ease of cleaning, uh, it's not gonna be quite as easy as a down alternative, which you can do commercially, uh, or just like a big commercial uh, dryer and washer. You're actually gonna have to go to to a dry cleaner to have this professional cleaned. All right, just to wrap up on the Pacific Coast Down Comforter, I had a nice experience with this, nice warmth of breathability. I felt warm without feeling too stuffy. Uh, really great price as well at $130 for a down comforter. Um, though I would consider your preferences when looking at this, it's gonna be right down the middle as a down comforter. If you're, like a, if you're a hotter or a cooler sleeper, just considering that when, when shopping. That kind of does it for the Pacific Coast Down Comforter. Um, if you'd like more information, just please uh, click on the link in the description below.